Hi there everyone, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps and thank you for joining me for another demonstration today. We are going to be using our acrylic sprays and our mystical sprays. I've got some watercolour card, so I've got a couple of colours, a cranberry red, sun yellow, that's in the acrylics and I'm going to use pink colour in the mica sprays, the amber green and the spring moss. So I've got my water as well because I'm going to put a little bit of water on to the mica sprays just to get that little bit of a reaction to give us a bit of texture. So that's the acrylic and that's the cranberry and then we're going to go with the mysticals. Pink colour, and we've got a bit of spring moss as well. So, got quite a lot going on here. I'm going to pop some water on the side, pick up my fan brush, and just start. Dab in over the top. I'm going to use my finger just to add a little bit more texture again. Okay, let's start drying off and see see where it takes us. So I want to make sure that that is completely dry because I am going to do some embossing over the top of this now. I think that's pretty good. Let's give it a little bit of a bend back into shape. And now we're going to use one of our lovely flowers. So this is a Lilium. And I'm going to use the Versamark on this. And I'm going to stamp down the bottom here for our first one. Okay. And the ink up again. And we're going to do another one a little bit further up there. Give that a good press. Need to make sure that we get that lovely detail through the embossing powder. So this time I've got the opaque vanilla white and I'm just going to sprinkle that over the top. Give that a bit of a tap and have a look at it to make sure that it's not going to go on any of the areas that you don't want. If it does, then just get a little brush and just tease that off. And I think that's good to go. Let's pop that back. And then let's heat that up and set the design. And there we 
we go. And that's all done. Got some words here, some nice spring words. So I'm going to ink up in the warm breeze. And I'm going to take that first one off. And then I'm going to pop that in the background there. And we'll do the same down the bottom. a few little stamp down here um, I forget what it's called I'm sorry it will be in the description though and I'm just gonna add give us a little bit of depth down at the bottom here I'm going to ink up in the twilight. Sometimes you can never tell what it's going to what it's going to need until you're actually creating the card. And then you just feel like it needs a little bit of something else. So and there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not very good at planning. I kind of go with the flow. So we've got a lovely background, that mica is just coming through, gorgeous. What are we going to do now? We need a little bit of Posca and then a little bit of glitter. And you never forget that little bit of attention to detail, it makes all the difference. got some lovely stickles this is um, golden wood so but if you haven't got this color don't worry there's plenty of other colors that you can use and I'm just gonna drag that down just following where I've stamped And there we have another really quick and easy card to produce something quite simple. The sprays are a great starting point to create a really nice background. Thank you once again for joining me today. I hope it's inspired you to have a go yourselves. You take care and I'll see you very soon. Bye for now.